Hello everyone, welcome to Building the Ultimate Matchbox Car Collection. My name is Tyrone and today I present to you Wave C or Mix C of Moving Parts for 2021. Uh, where do we start? There are six in this little lineup. Uh, there's 20 in the set, but here are six. First one I'll open is the 2016 Chevy Camaro in white to go with my blue gold, green and red. I'll bring those on in a second. Um, there's the back, if you are interested. These uh, so-called bow tie packets are probably Matchbox's least popular in my estimation. Uh, but the Camaro is looking splendid in white sort of a pearly metallic white that engine bay actually looks more detailed maybe it's just uh, standing out more because of the color yeah I like that Camaro on the license plate close that for the one and only time I don't tend to open and close things around here maybe just the once for your benefit and then they stay shut try and get it symmetrical I always like things to be symmetrical that's nice so that's a very good first start put him over here while we attack another packet, uh, the 1950 Chevy Suburban 11 of 20 with the opening bonnet in National Parks livery. To add to the growing number of National Parks vehicles. Oh, that's nice. Nice clean paint job there. Oops, don't get your head stuck in there, will you? Little splash of colour, that's all we need, isn't it? Nice clear windows on this one. To see the slab of a um, steering wheel, but nonetheless. Chrome base, I think I showed you the base on that one, didn't I? Yep. Yeah, lovely addition to the National Parks lineup. Who next? Uh, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. the 2019 Ford Ranger with two opening parts. Ford Ranger is extremely popular on Australian roads. Everybody wants one. It's either this or the to Toyota Hilux. Um, they're in the same category, competing directly with one another. I'm not sure who's winning. It's usually the Toyota, but you see a great many of this on Australian roads. And it's uh, Raptor um, counterpart. Not counterpart, upgraded version, I suppose. More um, put your road bikes or dirt bikes on the back type vehicle, the Raptor. But it's looking lovely in metallic blue. So that's that's complete, whoops, completely different blue, because I just caved in the air spoiler on the, <laughs> on the Camaro. Be careful, Tyrone. Goodness. Uh, who next? You next. The 1963 Chevy C10 pickup in gold. Hmm. This one's been a moving parts um, casting for a little bit. Number 16, no, number 18 of 20. So I struggled to focus after a big night. Hey. 
on that massive slab of bonnet, quite amusing. But down she goes. Um, and what do we have in that lineup? Got a dark blue one. Moon eyes with the rubber tires. Get the destruction out of our faces. That's better. Kind of get them mixed up, aren't I? Yeah, they look really good actually. Um, so we'll put those in the background because they are just the friends welcoming in the new ones, aren't they? And there. Oh. Fluking the color palette behind all these guys. Quite happy to see. What do we need now? We need this one, 1982 Datsun 280ZX, before it became Nissan. Huh, look at the old Datsun logo. See? Remember that on the car dealerships in the early 80s? Number 17 of 20. Looking forward to seeing this one out. That colour suits this car, doesn't it? I'm scared about how this door's going to close. I know. Proven me wrong. I like to be proved wrong when it comes to that. Humongous door. Yes, thankfully it closes without incident. <laughs> Hasn't been around for a long time this casting, but long enough to get three variants already. Hey, different wheels each time too. Grand. Really, really good. So that can finish out the backup singers in the back because we've got a new casting in 16 of 20 the 2020 BMW M4 Cabriolet in a stunning purpley blue with white interior that just makes that paint job shine there's the back before we say goodbye to more packaging goodbye I really hope these doors do the door thing. Oh, what a mean looking front. One of BMW's better efforts. Shame about the steering wheel, but yeah, what do you do? Oh, that was a nice thump. Oh. Matchbox, where are we now? Should we try that again or it just decide to fold in on itself? Oh, wow, didn't they do well? I've got to open both of them now. They open evenly. Oh, I'm impressed. Is this a sign of things to come? I hope so. Look at the color of this car. It's not metallic. I thought it looked metallic through the blister, but it is not. That's nice. Oh, I hope to see more of this one. I wonder what it replaced. I really hope it didn't replace the Porsche. Strangely, they've, they've put um, Matchbox across that back bumper. I could have done without that. Not sure about that at all but the front I'm digging you've got the little racing flick red and blue hmm very stylish 
Yeah. Come a little closer, said the spider to the fly. That's nice. That's the star of the show, I think. Uh, very happy to have the others, especially my colour variants. Beautiful. Okay, guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, like, share, subscribe, comment down below. I'm sure there are cars I've missed or am missing. I always doubt myself when I become sure that I've got every colour. Um, as soon as I've turned off the camera and rummaged through some more of my collection, I find another one that should have made it to the video but didn't. But uh, that's the essence of this hobby, isn't it? There are a million variants to chase after, keeping us forever occupied and happy. <laughs> I'll see you in the next video. Bye.